My name is Honorable Penina Malonsa, Cabinet Secretary for Tourism, Wildlife and Heritage in Kenya. I want to take this opportunity to welcome you for the first wildlife scientific conference that will be happening in this country for the first time in Naivasha from 26 to 28 September this year. Kenya is a known authority in wildlife conservation and more so Kenya is cradle of mankind. So walk up home even as we explore and learn together. Karibuni. Uh, good morning everyone. My name is Sylvia Museya, Principal Secretary in the State Department for Wildlife under the Ministry of Tourism, Wildlife and uh, Culture. The one thing that there is in this country is that we have too many laws, we have too many policies, we have too many institutions, yet we continue to lose our biodiversity, we continue to lose our forest, we continue to lose our, our waters. And so policy makers seem to be making decisions at the table without enough data. And so this becomes very important because uh, the scientific conference will bring into play uh, the importance of data-driven decision by policy makers. Therefore, we anticipate that we will be able to make better decisions that are backed by data. And that is why this conference is very important to us. My name is uh, Herastas Kanga. I am the Director General of the Kenya Wildlife Service. And uh, I want to welcome all the viewers into the first ever Wildlife Scientific Conference for Kenya. And uh, this conference is uh, done through partnership with our sister organization, uh, the Wildlife Research and Training Institute, which was uh, actually created as a uh, part of the Wildlife Conservation Management Act. And uh, the Kenya Wildlife Service seeded the initial cohort of our staff that have created this important organization. Uh, from where we sit as uh, park managers and water managers, we cannot uh, do any management without science and information. So the principle of uh, this scientific uh, conference is that you can only be able to manage what you know and what you can measure. That is the basic bottom line. For us as park managers, to be able to manage the millions populations of wildlife that we have in this country across the national parks, the national reserves, the conservancies and the sanctuaries, we require information. The Kenya Wildlife Service is an information and science lend institution. Every decision that we make, every policy that uh, we produce has to be backed by science, information and data. My name is uh, Dr. Patrick Omondi. I'm the director and CEO of the Wildlife Research and Training Institute. Yes, one of the key mandates um, of the Wildlife Institute is to establish a national data portal. A lot of research has been done before in this country, but they're individuals, they're in PhD and peer reviewed journal. So we want to bring this information together and this uh, conference is one of those platforms we'll use to get cutting edge uh, information on technology to manage uh, challenges of uh, uh, connectivity, uh, to manage challenges of human wildlife coexistence, how do we deal with human wildlife conflict, and the technology, how we monitor our wildlife real time. We have various um, uh, papers over 127 papers that uh, have been um, shortlisted for presentation all aligned to the National Wildlife Research Agenda that the country recently launched. Registration is open. You can actually walk in and register. And you can visit our website www.wrti.go.ke to register anytime before and during the conference. And uh, in the website, you'll also get contact details in case you have a problem. Naivasa is safe, the country is safe. Please welcome to the first Wildlife Scientific Conference.